Hi, I'm Sandra Bernhard, actress and comedian living here in New York City. Today, I'm hanging out with Liz Winstead, comedian and co-creator of The Daily Show, and a great old friend. Hi. Hi, baby. I almost wiped out. You know, you get those vintage shoes, and I was like, oh, no. What are you Funny, doing? chic. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're just going to stroll around Manhattan, get our nails done, and have a little ketchup. I never walk for leisure. Walking is not for leisure. Sitting is for leisure. Walking is for leisure. Sleeping is, is for wrong with leisure. You? With my mother, who can't even walk anymore, I'm like, can you move for f's sake? I mean, she's had a stroke, and I'm harassing my own mother to walk faster. This is Comedians Walking and Getting Manny Petties. A good Manny Petty is so wonderful. I know. I have to pick out uh, color. I don't know, what do you think of this? Oh, that's fun. Should I do that on my toenails? Yeah. Does this look like barf? I don't like that for summer. And for feet. No. No, that, yeah. you're already encouraging a, a dull foot with that. Yes, I don't want to do that. Have you ever had a colonoscopy? You know my father was a proctologist. I did not know that. Yeah. First time I ever had a procedure, my father gave it to me. What was the procedure? It was some sort of a, a short scope. And my mother was there. A short scope? Like for oh. junior, it's a junior colonoscopy? Was there any earthly reason why you needed it? Because I had IBS and he thought he should just do it, take it upon himself. Why, you're, you're now reflecting. I see you going, maybe I didn't need that. Maybe I'm weirded out. Maybe. <laughs> and my mother was there as, as the nurse. Now, is she a nurse? No! Oh my god, this is sounding She's like... She's an abstract artist! <laughs> I'm from Minnesota. And like every year I go home to the Minnesota State Fair. And every year they have um, something called Princess K of the Milky Way. And it's the farm princesses, but they carve their likenesses out of butter. <laughs> the fact that we live in a nation where we make sculptures out of butter <laughs> Because we have all this extra food, in, apparently, in the world, where we can just carve, you know, Miss Farmington <laughs> out of butter instead of going, wow, people might be starving. Let's send Miss Farmington's head down to the local <laughs> shelter. The way we eat, it's so terrifying. I mean, this is the only country where ranch dressing is, like, labeled a beverage, <laughs> I think. You know, in these big box stores, and people just amble in and shove things in their face. They don't even know what they're doing. Oh, I know. Here's some rubber gloves coming at your mouth with like a jalapeno deep fried pepper-sicle, <laughs> and you're like, I'll tap that. And they just eat and shove and eat. And it's like, why do you need all that food? Have you seen those people? They come out of Costco, and they have this giant silo of pretzel rods. And you're like, are you building a fence? What are you doing with this food? It's crazy. My 14-year-old daughter, Sicily, we watch that show Girls because I really like it. But the sex is really like a little bit too much. It's grown up. It's jaded also. It's jaded, exactly. And I don't want Sicily to see that. But it's too awful. close to home because we're li we live in New York. Yeah. She loves Brooklyn. They're the cute boys from Brooklyn, you know. She will spend time in Brooklyn when she gets a little older. And when okay. she starts dating, she can stay with you. I'll set her up with some really horrible guys so she gets a really good feel for life. Well, I just want to make sure there's, you know, no sexually transmitted diseases thing. In my house? Yeah. No. Honey. You know. There's no sexual transmission in my house. That is rich. And you know where you don't meet guys? Planned Parenthood functions. You would think there would be tons of men flocking to repro rights uh, benefits because, you know, the ladies enjoy the sex. And not so much. I just feel like right now, it's if you don't agree with people, then you're evil. It's right. not like we just disagree. Right. Now there's some sort of an evil influence. Yeah. I mean, can you imagine if you said, I don't eat hamburgers, and I went, you're going to hell. Because that's about as ridiculous as it is. Well, I know. Because you wow. hate America. Yeah, because then, yeah. Suddenly, everything is like a threat to the American way. Wow. You're really scaring Go. me. Yourself. You know, I mean, like, because that's what it's like. 
I cannot wait to get this outfit off because I'm matchy, matchy, matchy. With your toes? Yeah. Look at my toes, do you like? I love. Anyway, on that note, I think our nails are dry. Look at that, that's a summery toe, ladies that and gentlemen. That is a festive toe. My toe is- Fiesta wear toe. I've got a statement toe. Oh my God. A metallic. You're Metallica. You're giving a summer heavy metal toe. Let's walk out. All right. Wait a minute. For Let's make a sake. What you forgot? <gasps> the most of these candies. Oh my God, you are an angel. Are they chewy or sucky? Yeah, chewy. Oh my God, this say. makes me so intensely no. happy. My mother used to get chocolate covered ginger. I have never heard of that in my life. It sounds awful. She used to eat them by the box well, and then have diarrhea and go, I don't understand why I've got diarrhea. Come on, let's go. If I smudge, I'm already pissed. This is Sandra Bernhard, and you're watching Thinker.